Brouwer had become very famous with his topological theorems. And actually, they are not strictly constructivist. And Brouwer knew it, but he figured that he later, in some later phase, would be able to give uh, acceptable constructivist proofs. That's what he thought. Some have said that he was a little bit of an opportunist, that he wanted to become famous in the way that the world would accept. I, well, everybody is, from my point of view, sometimes a little bit of an opportunist, so that's, for me that, 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 that's okay. But nevertheless, he was aware of the fact that his, his topological proofs were not acceptable, strictly speaking, from his own point of view. And then when he had become famous, he had a perfect relation with Hilbert in Göttingen. And Hilbert was the, 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 the king of, of mathematics at the time. After the death of Poincaré, it was Hilbert who was the king, uh, sitting in his, on his throne in Göttingen in Germany. Uh, and Brouwer became editor of the Mathematische Annale. That was the, the, the journal for mathematics, uh, uh, which was led by Hilbert. Uh, and then, after the First World War, Brouwer started to publish about constructive it, his mathematics, and it slowly became clear that it would be very hard to get certain classical results, and that they probably would have to be rejected. Well, that was still okay. But then other mathematicians, like Hermann Weyl, for example, uh, started saying that they liked Brouwer's ideas, and Hilbert considered uh, Brouwer at a certain moment as a danger for traditional classical mathematics. There was this revolutionary, it's actually called the Revolution in some texts, there was this revolutionary, well, the, 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 the Russian Revolution lay just behind them, you know, the, whole, the, the, the Russian Empire was taken over by the communists, and there was this mathematical communist with his extreme ideas going to finish a considerable part of traditional mathematics. And that is why Hilbert decided that Brouwer had to be removed from the uh, editorial board of the Mathematische Annalen. Einstein was also on the board. Carl Theodori was on the board. Einstein was a bit neutral. He, he thought that Hilbert was exaggerating, but, but he did not really object. That was dramatic for, uh, for, for Brouwer. That's, that's that part of the story.